on this Memorial Day, bringing life to the USS Arizona Memorial. The National Park Service today unveiling a project that will share the story of the war and this living monument with future generations around the world. It's a site 1.7 million visitors come to see each year, the USS Arizona and its memorial. But there's so much more to see of this underwater monument. The only existing record of the USS Arizona is a hand drawing until now. The National Park Service and technology company Autodesk have just completed the first comprehensive digital survey of the ship and memorial. And for the first time, technology like LIDAR, sonar, photographs, and underwater laser scanning were all used to create 3D models. Last year, divers surveyed the sunken wreck, and today they showed off some of what has come out of this first of its kind technological collaboration. Take a look at this 3D model of a Coke bottle and another of a cooking pot. Items that sat on the ship's galley for the past 72 years. Now a chance to see what these items actually look like. National Park Service Daniel Martinez actually tagged that very pot while on an earlier dive. He says this technology will help in telling the story of the ship that sank and the 1,177 who went down with it. See it. Uh you know, in three-dimensional model, um, that's the kind of thing that will connect with not only the young and the old, but anyone that comes to this site. Only nine crew members of the USS Arizona are still alive. Don Stratton is one of those. He was 19 the morning of the attack. The bomb hit in the bow of the ship, and a million pounds of emanation exploded and blew the 110 foot of the bow of the ship clear off and the ship's fireball went about five or 600 foot in the air and just enveloped us. He was burned over 65% of his body, but he made it out alive and today has returned to the Arizona more than a dozen times. He's excited about the new technology and how it will help future generations to never forget. It will also help in preserving this national landmark. Well, for the first time, we'll be able to actually measure what's going on. So the images we capture here in 2014, we can go back three years from now and see if there's any changes. Is the ship shifting? Is the biogrowth increasing or decreasing? Still there, and it's still my ship. Now, new technology will share Don's ship with future generations. And I think it'll connect with young people that will be able to visit the memorial, no matter the memorial and the shipwreck of the Arizona, wherever they are in the world. Now that 3D technology isn't new itself, Autodesk has worked extensively in the film industry, including the film Avatar. All the work on this project, from local to national companies, the Navy and Coast Guard, was all done pro bono.